Well, only on two tonight, an ER nurse was beaten up while waiting in the Whataburger drive through line. The injured nurse says the assault was caused when she accidentally bumped into the SUV in front of her. Good evening and thank you for joining us. I'm Keith Garvin. Daniela Guzman is off this evening. This happened in Houston's South Side neighborhood along Old Spanish Trail. Our Gage Golding spoke with the victim who is still dealing with the injuries. Gage. Yeah, Keith, she has a bruise up face, a busted lip, and even a broken blood vessel in her eye. All of this because she gave somebody a little bump in the drive through line here at the Whataburger. Welcome to Whataburger. What can we get for you today? I ordered a number 13, two gravies, and a cinnamon roll with a root beer to drink. It's this 29 year old nurse's go to Whataburger order, a quick meal after a long day on Sunday. Well, what was supposed to be at least. I usually put my car in park when there's a long line. She thought she was in park, so she let her foot off the brake. Her car creeping forward and bumping the vehicle in front of her. In the nurse's words, this is a true accident, but the lady in front, well, she wasn't buying it. I had rolled down my window to ask, and I apologize. I said, I'm sorry, did I hit your car? And immediately she got out and started screaming, told me to move my car back. Oh, she said a lot more than just that. This woman spilling swear words from her mouth that might even make a sailor blush. No, go that way. F On top of that, she opened the nurse's door and beat her not once, but twice. This video capturing the second round. So I couldn't really see. I was a little disoriented. Like she had hit my head. We're concealing your identity for this interview because you were scared of what she could do to you. That Whataburger is really close to my house. I would not be surprised if she lived in the same area as me. I just want her to realize that I'm somebody's daughter, just like she is. I can tell she hurt you not only physically, but also emotionally. Yeah, the scars will go away. You know, the, the bruises will heal, the swelling will go down, but I just felt so dehumanized. All right, so after all this happened, our victim, she went home expecting to see some sort of damage to the front of her car, right? Of course, if somebody was that upset over an accident, you'd expect to see something, but you can see for yourself, not even a scratch on the front of her white sedan. So uh, this is where the Houston police come in. This is where they need your help. They're asking for any information, any tips. If you know who this woman is, please pick up the phone and call. They say the woman is described to be in her late 30s or early 40s. She was driving a dark colored SUV, possibly maybe a dark blue Mercedes. Mercedes SUV is what we're thinking at this time. If you know anything at all, pick up the phone and call Crime Stoppers. Live in the South Side, Gage Golding, KPRC 2 News.